We're going to walk through the steps to drain your bun velocity brew. The reasons you will want to drain your tank if you're going to be gone for an extended period of time, if you're going on vacation or something like that, if you're going to move and you need to pack your brewer up and take it with you, uh, or if you're going to ship it somewhere. If it's going to go through UPS or FedEx and be on an airplane, you don't want the tank to have water in it. So the first thing that we need to do is to unplug the brewer. We want to cool off the water that's in the hot tank. So we're going to pour in cold water to flush the hot water out. So we put the carafe on the warmer plate area and we close the lid. And the cold water is pushing hot water out into the carafe. We'll want to do that twice so that we can push all of the hot water out of the internal hot water tank. Now that you have flushed the hot water from the internal tank with two full cold carafes of water, we can start the draining process. First thing we have to do is remove the brew funnel and the spray head and set them aside. Then we need to take the brewer to a sink, grasp the back of the brewer, and tip it upside down until water starts to flow out of the opening from the spray head tube. Most of the water will flow out of that tube opening, but some might come out of the top lid. You just keep pouring the water out until no more comes out. Now that all the water is drained, we want to replace the spray head by twisting it on in a clockwise direction and insert the brew funnel.